Thank you. Hello everybody, my name is Craig Bennett, and today I am going to get into a kind of a QA. and a I got someone else's code in front of me, one of my viewers. Uh, real quick, I'm not going to do this for everybody. This does take quite a bit of time. If you want me to take a look at and poke around and, and see one or two things, I expect that you basically ran through all your other resources before he came to me in this case the reason why I'm, I'm showing this is because I imagine there's dozens of other people with the same problem and I'm not going to reveal the person's name mostly because it's a simple few mistakes but it's best to get them out now versus later on so if you did this i can guarantee if you did this in a workplace you would be fired uh but you're not in a workplace it's time to learn it so we go from there i don't one, one thing i want to know is, is there's a few things on here that i don't understand i don't understand why there are imports um i don't understand this um so I don't understand what that's about. I'm leaving it in case that they want to build up this application to go beyond and do some other things. It's cool, whatever. But um, I'm just going to leave it at that. Also, another thing is if, is if you want, you can actually go ahead and do something like that. If you're doing a single line comments, you can do that. There's really three ways to do comments. It's that, the two dashes like I said and this um so it's cool it, it it's up to you I'm leaving as it is because you know it, it's your deal but uh, so one of the problems they have is illegal voids anything illegal usually has something to deal with the syntax uh, bad syntax uh, so let's go with the first major problem um, so going into here, if we actually go and and this is why I advise using something like Android Studio or, or some compiler that is well used like Android Studio, because if you're coding within like Notepad, you're not going to be able to catch these things that I can literally click and see where things start and end. And I can get a bunch of warnings and I can see exactly what is the uh, problem. Uh, at least um, I can get a general, but um, and I'm pretty sure they are because they, they mentioned that they got that. So with that, you got a class that starts and ends right there. That's not good. You want to add. I, I don't understand why this isn't in there. So with that, you want to put the on create instance within here um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to comment that out and uh, earmark it so I can type some notes into it so I can send it to them um, and then what we want to do is go ahead and put in a thing and we magically fix the illegal voids because now everything is within the class when that's out of the class, it, it's saying that you can't do this. It's it's not illegal. Think of uh, um, laws of physics being illegal. Not illegal like speeding. Speeding, fine. You can go a little faster or whatever. Or murder or whatever. You can still do those things even though it's illegal and highly immoral. In this case, uh, what we have is in physics, you cannot do it if it's against the laws of physics. And same thing applies here is it won't compile and it won't be able to read it because it's completely against the rules. So as far as the next thing, well, we have it right there and in right there. So... We need to fix that. 
and we have that there. In fact, um, let me comment that out. And now we have this. Let's uh, go ahead and do this. I'm going to copy all of this out, cut it because there's just too much wrong with it. Um, basically right here, if we take a look at it, we got a on-click listener with nothing in it. A uh, on-click right here with nothing in it. A uh, narrow on-click listener with, okay, it doesn't really associate anything. Right here we have the strings, um, they need to be capitalized. So, sorry there, it, it fixed that itself when you did that. Here, it doesn't even have a listener. So, you know, you'll have something like that. Or, or whatever you put here, it needs to be here. Um, but, you know, it's non right space and to start with. Um, so, there's a lot to work on. Um, I'm just going to copy all that out. And... As you see here, that fixes all the errors in itself. So what we're going to do is go ahead and do a view on click listener. And instead of doing the rundown, I, I can just you know do it off camera and magic editing and whatnot. But anyways, uh, again, this needs to be capitalized. It's very important that this is correct. Otherwise, it won't be able to read it. And we got rid of all the errors, and that's good. I'm going to comment on this some quite a bit to help the person out. So again, I'm, I'm doing this video mostly to help the dozens of others that are too afraid to come forward. But it's best to learn this now before we get into a uh, professional position. Because a lot of this is um, pretty basic to uh, to learn. But anyways, as far as that goes, I think that's everything. As far as that goes, um, again, I don't know what this is about um, or that's about. But I'm going to leave it in because they have it in. So they might have a plan in, in mind. Um, leave questions, whatever, uh, below. Uh, and... and if you do have any questions about coding or whatever for them, and you want me to take a look at your code, again, use all your resources before you come to me, Stack Overflow included, and then make sure you have it on GitHub, and that way I can take a look at it and, and do it. But anyways, as far as that goes, uh, leave a like, subscribe, share, uh, check out the Patreon and, and whatnot, so uh, help out this channel with Patreon and donations. But uh, see you in the next video. I hope you have a great day.